Central PA is home to many haunted attractions and urban legends. One of them is right off of Interstate 83 in the Lewisbury area that's hands on so you can test it out yourself. I try out the phenomenon at Gravity Hill, but also investigate if there's a non paranormal explanation to what happens. We are going to be giving this thing a try. Oh, holy tamale. Gravity Hill has attracted hundreds over the years, including YouTubers trying to test out the supposed natural phenomenon. The idea here is that you drive downhill on Pleasant View Road toward the intersection at Windermere Road, then stop and put on your four ways. You put your car in neutral, and then you'll actually appear to roll backwards uphill. An urban legend says it's the ghosts of kids pushing you uphill, trying to spare you from their gruesome fate. They died when their school bus collided with a train at that intersection. So ghosts, or is there something else going on here? Say something scientific. It's an, it's an optical illusion. Robert Fury, professor of integrated sciences at Harrisburg University, has taught lessons on this in the past. What you're actually seeing is um, clues on the horizon uh, uh, that, that make you think that the angles are different from what they actually are. The mind wants to think that the intersecting road is perpendicular, but in reality, it is not. They use water to show this is not the case, and that's where the illusion starts in our minds. The angle of the road to the side and the, these, these visual clues and cues that you get from looking around you make it look like it's rolling backwards up the hill. But in reality, there's a three foot dip right before the intersection that's making the vehicle roll. When, when the cars roll, they look like they're rolling backwards up the hill, but in fact, they're rolling backwards down a slight hill. So what about fingerprints? The legends claim if you throw flour on your car, you see the fingerprints of the kids. Well, Fury has a very scientific explanation for this one as well. He says it's just like taking actual fingerprints. If you put these this dust on the car, the oil that somebody's hand left there acts like a fingerprint, and, and so you think you're seeing ghost hand prints. And it's also worth noting that there is no railroad nearby and never has been one. So as cool as it is to experience, it's not supernatural activity, and we can lay that one to rest. <laughs> Whoa! Holy cow! That, that's pretty cool. That's spooky. I know, right? But it's guess, cool. Yeah, you saw me test it out. Yeah, but it is all, it, it, it's all physics. Because there's just such a shallow dip, yeah. you really are rolling, mm -hmm. but you're rolling downhill as opposed to uphill because of the dip. It's just so shallow. Just the movement, you're looking in the back, you're looking in the front. It does feel and look like you're moving uphill. The sensation, it's crazy. When I saw that, I thought it was edited in reverse. I'm like, there's no way that this <laughs> is going backwards up the hill. I did it multiple times because wow. Our cameraman, Nick, I mean, we had our flashers on, we moved out of the way. <laughs> right, we we were need, safe. You know, if a car was coming, we were careful. And you should be too if you want to give this a try. But yeah, it was just, wow. It was so fun. I was really nerding out. What a I, was, story. I wasn't sure if like, the YouTubers were faking yeah. it because you know how they right. can do that yeah. and whatnot. Yeah. But yeah, it was really cool. That was a good one, Andrew. <laughs> I really liked that one a lot. Yeah, all in the spirit of Halloween.